Oh shit, I got bitch slapped by the divine! Hey internet, it's Jessica and welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition! And from where we left off last time, Solus was having a huge boner because we are in the Fade physically right now. Clearly this is not a good thing because you're not supposed to be here technically. Um, there's a reason why uh, the veil is set up, you know what I mean? Nobody's supposed to go into the Fade physically. And this happened the first time in the beginning of Dragon Age Inquisition. Elia came through the veil and she fell out from the Fade. But the thing is she doesn't remember what happened. So, right now, our only shot right now is to get to that giant hole over there and hopefully we can escape. But, you know, that probably won't be as easy as we think it will be, because <laughs> why would it? What the fuck? What? That can't be. Uh... I greet you, Warden. And you, Champion. This is awkward. She died though, remember? You were dead. I don't recall the divine glowing. In my experience, that's something spirits do. You hmm. think my survival impossible. Yet, here you stand alive. Surely okay. you can understand our concerns and explain what you are. I am here to help you. That doesn't... You do not remember what happened at the okay. Temple of Sacred Ashes. No, Elia does not remember. Okay, one thing also, because... Well, Hawk is a mage as well, but Elia is a mage. And typically... In Thetis, if you're a mage, you are able to- You're more attracted to, to like, demons and spirits than, like, other people. Because, uh, because of magic, obviously. So, if she's a spirit, that could also mean she's a demon, right? So, um, you can understand why everybody's just kind of like, you know, what the hell's going on? First of all, how do you know I'm Inquisitor? The real divine would have no way of knowing that I'd been made Inquisitor. I know. Because I have examined memories like yours, stolen by the demon that serves Corypheus. The false calling that terrified the Wardens into making such grave mistakes. It's work. I'd like to have a few words with this nightmare about that. You Great, so there's chance, a demon called Nightmare right, here. That's, this you know, that will end well. Is its lair, but the nightmare serves willingly. For Corypheus, has brought much terror to this world. He was one of the magisters who unleashed the first blight upon the world, was he not? Oh, so Every is this confirmed? As the archdemon circles. Every dwarf's whimper in the deep roads. It's official, Corypheus is a Tevinter Magister, the first one, one of the first ones, to enter the Golden City and corrupt it and cause the blight. So everybody give a hand to Corypheus for fucking ruining the world. Ah! When you entered the Fade at Heaven, the demon took a part of you. Before you do anything else, you must recover it. These are your memories, Inquisitor. Uh, spirits? Cool, we're gonna fight our memories, guys, because, you know, this makes sense completely. Okay, so, these are my memories, huh? Bring forth the sacrifice. Uh-oh. What the fuck? The oh, those are the Grey Wardens, yeah? Yeah, they are. So he already had control of them a long time ago. Now is the hour of our truth. Shut up, dude. Why are you doing this? You, of all people. Keep the sacrifice still. Hey, that's the uh, orb Someone that Solus was talking about. But what I don't get is why he was using the divine as a sacrifice. What's going on here? Uh oh, that's us. Oh shit, got bitch slapped by the divine! Take that. Uh oh. Okay. So that mark on your hand. It wasn't sent by Andraste. 
It came from that orb Carithus yeah. is using. Yeah. Well, I mean, I always Carithus thought that, so. to rip open the veil, use the anchor to enter the fade and throw open the doors of the Black City. Not for the old gods, but for himself. When you disrupted his plan, the orb bestowed the anchor upon you instead. We need to get out of here, though. I don't want to be a dick right now and be like, oh, yeah, that's what I suspected. Because, you know, literally... Uh, everybody in my party except for Solus and, and Cole are are Andrastian, so I don't want to offend anybody right now, so let's get the hell out of here. Was that everything you wanted me to see? For the time being, you cannot escape the lair of the nightmare until you regain all that it took from you. What's wrong, Hawk? Those were Grey Wardens holding the Divine in that vision. Their actions led to her death. Uh -huh, Aha, come on. Corypheus took their minds. You've seen it happen yourself. Divine. Please say that was her. I don't know, Sarah. Right? We have survived in the Fade physically. Perhaps she did as well. Or, if it is a spirit that identifies so strongly with Justinia that it believes it is her, how can we say it is not? Whatever yeah. she is, she seems to want to help us. So she's not real? Then the nightmare's fake too, right? Right? It's nothing like me. I make people forget to help them. It eats their fears. I don't know if I could do that, but I don't. I don't want to. That's not me. That's not you, Cole. Peace, Cole. None of us mistake you for the nightmare. It is a fear demon, as I suspected. Likely drawing on terrors related to the blight. Fear is a very old, very strong feeling. It predates love, pride, compassion, every emotion. Save perhaps desire. Be wary. The nightmare will do anything in its power to weaken our resolve. But after what it did to the Wardens, it's going to learn to fear for itself. So like I said in the beginning of this Let's Play, I have played Dragon Age Inquisition like five bajillion times. Um, but I, I, I want to say the first playthrough, I did romance Solus, but I never brought him everywhere. And this pl playthrough, I'm going to do that just because of what he says. And I think the first time I, I came to the Fate, I never brought Solus. So everything he's saying right now is pretty interesting. Also, have you noticed, like, some of the stuff in the Fate is, like, from Thetis, like, in the real world? Like, it's kind of weird. Like this. What is this? Uh, Why are so we have goddamn. A Whoa, who the hell some is this? Some silly little girl comes to steal the fear I kindly lifted from her shoulders. Is that Corypheus? Fuck you. You should have thanked me and left your fear where it lay, forgotten. You think that pain will make you stronger. What fool filled your mind with such drivel? The only one who grows stronger from your fears is me. But you are a guest here in my home, so by all means let me return what you have forgotten. That's it, right? Not so bad. You're not so bad! These are but minor servants of a nightmare. I hate this place. It's okay, Sarah. I know Sarah's very afraid right now because she doesn't exactly- Well, I don't blame her. Like, who likes- Look at the Fae. Like, who would like this shit? You know what I mean? It's kind of weird. Except for Zola's because he's weird. Um, but... I really don't blame her for freaking out. I would too. There's a lot of Alluvians also in this place, which I find very interesting. Hmm... The only other Illuvians we have seen in the Dragon Age series was in Dragon Age Origins in the DLC with Morrigan and the other one with Meryl she found and apparently was evil because she was using blood magic to control it and stuff so there. I don't know. What? What the hell's that? Oh, spiders! <laughs> wow! You know, that's, that's great. Interesting. What's interesting? What the fuck? Perhaps I should be afraid, facing the most powerful members of the Inquisition. <laughs> Sarah, 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 if you shoot an arrow at me, I'll know where you are. Ow, my head, bitch balls! <laughs> are you afraid, Cole? I can help you forget, just like you help other people. We're so very much alike, you and I. No. Durth ma herelan, ma banal in asalin, marsolas in amardin. 
Bonal, Nadas. I will translate that on the screen for anybody wondering what the hell he just said. Because um, if anybody doesn't know the, the elven language, uh, ancient elven is what that fear demon or nightmare demon and souls were talking about or, or using. And the Dalish don't really know all of the elven language. So they that's why they name it ancient elven. So that's why not everything they can like, you know, read and, and shit. So that's the only problem with the Dalish as well. And Solus seems did to know Ancient Elvin, because, you know, did he's you a fucking nerd. anything you ever did mattered? What? You couldn't even save your city. How could you expect to strike down a god? You're a failure, and your family died knowing it. Those were little seeds. Tiny manifestations spawned from the nightmare itself. And they take the form of spiders. Something so many fear. Didn't see no spiders. I'd have taken bloody spiders. Remember. What? We walk in the Fade. Demons of fear shape their appearance to unnerve each of us. So okay. It's in my head. Knowing is not helping. Sorry, Sarah. So everybody sees it differently in the Fade. We see it as spider. Sarah sees it as something else. And that bitch-ass nightmare demon was like... railing on Hawk, saying... Uh, it's all her fault. Uh, that the city got burnt Kirkwall and then her family died and everything. Dude, fuck you, alright? Please tell me who you are. You're not the Divine, are you? you? Tell me who... What you are? I told you. I am helping you. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the episode right here. So, so far we just know that we're gonna fight a nightmare demon that has stolen our memories, but the only way we can leave the Fade is if we take our memories back. So this will be very interesting, and so far a lot of things have happened. It's been talking to us and saying a lot of interesting things to each of the companions. Uh, which will uh, play out later on in the story. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Dragon Age Inquisition, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to join the companions and let me know what you think of Dragon Age Inquisition so far. Especially if you haven't played this game, I'd like to hear everyone's opinion about the story because I love this game to death. I, like, honestly, I love this game so much. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye, everybody!